I am Anil Kumar and in this video we will learn how to solve a quadratic equation when it is given in vertex form. Question here is determine the solution for the equation y equals to 2 times x minus 3 whole square minus 8. Now what is the meaning of solution? Solution really means here find the value of x when the function is 0, right? That is what we mean solution. So solution means find x for y equals to 0. That is the meaning of solution, right? So let us substitute 0 for y and solve the equation. So we have 0 equals to 2 times x minus 3 whole square minus 8, correct? Now, let me rewrite this equation with 0 on the right side. So we have 2 times x minus 3 whole square minus 8 equals to 0. We'll bring 8 to the right side. That is the first step. 2 times x minus 3 whole square equals to plus 8. Now we'll divide by 2. x minus 3 whole square equals to 8 divided by 2, which is 4. Now we'll do square root. x minus 3 equals to square root of 4. Remember, whenever you do square root, you have to write plus and minus, both the signs. Now, you can bring 3 to the right side. So, get x equals to, when you bring 3 to the right side, you get 3 plus and minus, square root of 4 is 2. So, you get two possible solutions, correct? So, if I use plus, then I get one answer. If I use minus, I get the other answer. So, so what I'm trying to show here is, there are two possible solutions here. So let me use a different thing and write down both the solutions. So the first one we are writing as 3 plus 2, which is indeed 5. The other one is 3 minus 2, which is 1, right? So there are two solutions. We can write down our answer. So the solution is x is equals to 5 and 1, right? So these are the two solutions for the given equation. At times, you can also write solutions in curly brackets which gives you all the solutions, right? That is set of solutions. 5 and 1 is the solution for this given equation. I hope that helps. Thank you.